Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you guys can do your makeup for your Marie Rose cosplay. My cosplay was kindly given to me by Cospicky.com. I've got a link to their website and a discount code down in the description bar if you guys want to check it out. Marie Rose is definitely my favourite character from Dead or Alive. She is so cute and adorable and I love her outfit. So I'm really excited to show you guys my makeup for this look. To start us off, the lenses that I'm using for this cosplay are the iCody Colors of the Wind lenses in the color Crystal Water. As always, I got these lenses from Unixo and there will be a link and a discount code for the lenses down in the description bar. Okay, so let's start. So the first thing that I'm going to do is of course fill in my brows and yes, I know I definitely need to get my eyebrows plucked at the minute. <laughs> But I'm just going to simply fill in my brows with my Anastasia Dip Brow Promenade in the colour Blonde. Next, I'm going to take my Naked 2 palette from Urban Decay. To begin, I'm going to sweep the colour Booty Call all over my eyelid and then also I'm going to use it to subtly highlight my inner corners. And then to fill in my crease, I'm going to use the colour Tease. So I'm going to blend this into my crease and then I am also going to drag it down to my lower lash line and just blend it in. I'm just going to keep blending and blending and blending and then I'm also going to take the booty call colour again and just highlight under my brow bone. Ta da! Okay. So next I'm going to take my Tony Moly gel eyeliner and the first thing that I'm going to do with this is tight line my eyes. Now I'm going to try and explain um, as best I can what I do in this point. Basically it's going to look a little messy at first but once we fix it up it will be okay. So I'm going to line my eyes as I normally would with the gel eyeliner and then I'm going to create like a slight wing down and then I'm actually going to fill in my lower waterline and my lower lash line as well. And basically I'm going to try and blend in the line that I put on my waterline and on my lash line together to make my eyes look really really round. It will basically just give us really round cute baby doll eyes. And I actually forgot to record this part but actually all I do is cover the line that I created with the gel eyeliner with my Dolly Wink liquid eyeliner to make it more sharp. So now I'm taking a black eyeshadow and I'm just going to blend that in to the gel eyeliner that we put on my lower lash line. Next I'm going to generously coat my eyelashes in mascara. The mascara that I'm using is the Better Than Sex Mascara from Too Faced. So next I'm going to be using these false eyelashes. These are the Pure Series from Jewel Rich or something. Um, I got these from Tokyo Otaku Mode and Again, I do have a discount code for them, but it only lasts until um, halfway through March. For the lips, I'm going to my trusty Fresh Cherry Lip Tint from Etude House. I use this lip tint all the time for a lot of cosplays. It is great. Since Marie Rose doesn't seem to wear like a lot of colour on her lips, this is the perfect colour. So now I'm taking my Puff to Cheek blush in the colour pink, and I'm just going to apply this directly under my eye in a kind of circle motion for a baby doll look. And last but not least, a lot of the girls from Dead or Alive have really nice plump shiny lips and Mary Rose is no exception. So I'm taking this lip plumping gloss from a Etude House and applying it all over my lips. Okay guys, well that is it. We are finished with the makeup. I hope you guys have enjoyed this makeup tutorial. If so, then please give this video a thumbs up. And if you aren't already, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye!